Hello. Uh, so this is overcoming fear of loneliness. Uh, feeling lonely. Discover 18 ways to overcome loneliness. I don't know if I'll go through all 18 or not, but I found a list here. Um, so are you connected but still lonely? Use these strategies to overcome loneliness. The great irony is that we become increasingly connected on social media, video calling, and messaging. We simultaneously feel increasingly lonely. And even though we may use technology to feel more connected, it may be exactly what's leading us to feel lonely. After spending the last year researching and writing my new book, uh, this is the person who wrote this list, uh, wrote a book titled Outsmart Your Smartphone, Conscious Tech Habits for Finding Happiness, Balance, and Connection in Real Life. So, some of the things you can do um, to overcome loneliness. Number one, practice self-kindness. In difficult moments, it's essential to practice self-kindness. Blaming ourselves when we feel lonely is not helpful. So limit your hurtful self-talk. Two, capitalize on the present moment. Uh, I've talked a lot about mindfulness. I've studied a lot about mindfulness. I feel like this is going, you know, there instead of worrying so much about past or the future um, or even sharing all those things on social media just create small moments of savoring and connection with others that help you to overcome your loneliness three connect in real life connecting in real life may not be as easy as it once was we often default to our using our smartphones it's easier and now it's culturally accepted but we can decrease our loneliness if we build stronger in-person connections. Four, rethink how you spend your spare time. When we feel lonely, sometimes we just want to retreat into a corner and hide. Other times our endless to-do list may leave us too exhausted to go out and be social. But opting to stay alone every night with our phones, watching Netflix, or playing on Facebook can really get us stuck in loneliness. Five, do more things with people. Engaging in face-to-face -face social interactions tends to improve our mood and reduce um, depression. Six, talk to strangers. A growing body of research suggests that even seemingly trivial interactions with strangers, like chatting with a barista or cashier, may be able to keep loneliness at bay by helping us feel more socially connected. Seven, be active online. Instead of passively surfing the internet or social media, if you want to go online, opt instead to do something that involves the active participation of other people. For example, you can play games with others, chat about something you care about, something like that. Um, eight, share for real online. Somewhere along the way, the word sharing get co-opted on social media to describe what is really just humble bragging. We post about cool things we did, nice meals we ate, or a fun party we went to. All the things we didn't actually share with people who are viewing our posts. Instead of posting about things you did, reclaim the word share for what it really means. To give a small or large portion of what's yours to someone else. You could share advice, words of support, or even empathy. Nine, stop feeling, focusing on so much on you. It's almost inevitable in our modern technology crazed world that we start to believe we don't have enough. Um, especially when people are bragging on the internet. So instead of focusing on what you can get, shift your focus on what you can give. 10, stop your negative thought cycles. Um, we might repeatedly think about what we could have done differently to prevent ourselves from feeling so alone. 11, generate a sense of awe. Um, awe, which is like the sound when he misses the birth of a new baby, um, makes time seem like it's standing still and helps us to be more open to connecting. So expose yourself to something that creates awe, like landscapes, new experiences, new foods. 12. Spend money on experiences. If we're spending all our money on things anyway, we won't have the cash to spend money on experiences with others. So what they mean by experiences is go on a canoe trip, go wine tasting, play the beach party, that kind of thing. Um, 13. Play attention to things that matter. 
Um, how do we expect to improve our loneliness when we don't know what the cause is? It's hard. So it's helpful to start paying attention to the present moment. What are the experiences that make you feel lonely? 14, you can create a vision board. Um, I used to have a vision board tacked up to my wall on my desk. 15, um, tend to your network, so your network of people. Get connections, you know, be closer to them. Join an online group of like-minded people. Um, on the internet nowadays, you can find a group for just about anything. Uh, for example, politics, cooking, sports, um, crafts, you know. You can either volunteer remotely or real life. And then finally, 18, be nice to yourself. It's important to practice self-compassion when you fail at things. So that's it.